welcome to a new video. So for today's video, I will be doing a collab with my friend Alexa, reviewing and trying out the new curl line from Lush Cosmetics. I am so excited. I have been waiting for Lush to come out with a curl exclusive line for so long, and I am so excited to share with you my thoughts and experience with these products. So first off, I'm just giving you a little overview of all the products that I'll be reviewing for this video, and I'll get to styling in a little bit. So first I started off with the avocado co-wash and I really loved this solid co-wash because it has a nice lather to it. My hair and scalp felt thoroughly cleansed without feeling dry or stripped whatsoever. A really great option for someone that wants to co-wash their hair but still wants that lather. Next, I went in with the power conditioner and I loved this conditioner. It has protein, which you know my hair loves, and it left my hair feeling like butter so so good so first off for styling i'm just gonna give my hair a quick little brush through just to make sure i don't have any tangles side note look how long my hair is getting it is crazy now i'm gonna go in with the super milk leave-in this is a very light milky leave-in conditioner it really hydrated my hair this is a great option for anyone that has fine hair because it will not weigh your hair down i used so much of this and my hair just drank it up So since I'm doing the lock method, the second step for O is oil. And for oil, I am using the Rene Shea Souffle. Try saying that 10 times. <laughs> this is a balm that turns into an oil and it has the most amazing aroma, first of all. I also find it so incredibly moisturizing and hydrating on my hair. My hair felt so soft and buttery right when I put it on. I could just tell my hair was gonna love this stuff. I did use a teeny tiny bit too much possibly the first time I did use this. I did go ahead and use a little bit less for the log method, which I'll show you guys in a little bit. And for my last step for the lock method, I'm going in with the Curl Power Curl Cream. This has a really beautiful texture. It's thick and creamy, but not too heavy. It's sort of in, I'd say, a mid-weight texture. And my hair, again, just drank this cream up. It didn't feel heavy at all. It felt super moisturizing and hydrating. And it provided actually a fair amount of hold, which was super surprising. I haven't used a no gel or mousse routine in a long time. And I was super worried that this was gonna be a huge frizzy mess. But surprisingly enough, this gave me beautiful results. And I'm just gonna quickly define my curls with my tangle teaser off camera just because I don't want this video to be 200 years long and I'll be right back. And for my last step, real quick, just before I dry my hair, I'm just gonna take a little bit more of the Curl Power Curl Cream and scrunch it into my hair. I'm adding a tiny bit of water just to dilute it a little bit just to make it a little bit easier to disperse throughout my entire hair. <music> This is what my curls look like before I broke any big clumps or shook up my roots. This is what my curls are looking like after I finished diffusing my hair on day one. I really love how moisturized and shiny my hair looks and feels, but I will say I wasn't wowed by the volume I got on day one. I usually get a bit more volume and I was worried that this was going to be a bit of a wash day flop, but I'll show you how my results look like on day two. <music> Oh,
my curls are looking like on day two you guys the volume came out to play on day two i was a little worried like i mentioned before that my hair was just gonna get flatter and flatter but really it got bigger and bigger the definition was still so on point it was still super moisturized and hydrated i have no complaints whatsoever my hair just looked amazing i was so impressed <music> Again, no complaints. It looked just as good as day two, if not better. I swear this wash routine just got better and better as the days went on. So shiny, so many beautiful ringlets, so much volume, so much definition, just all good things. I'm in love. That's all I gotta say. <laughs> Next routine for the log method, I went in before with the Glory Conditioner, I left it on for about 5 minutes, and I really loved how buttery and soft it left my hair feeling. <laughs> So for the first step of the log method, it is liquid or leave-in, and I am using the Super Milk Leave-In Conditioner. It is a great prep first step to add some hydration and weightless moisture to your hair. <laughs> Next, I'm going in with the Renee's Shea Souffle for my oil. And last for the gel, I'm going in with one of my favorite gels, the Bounce Curl Light Cream Gel. All right, you guys, and this is the end of my video. This is the finished results of day one for the log method. I really loved my results, honestly, with everything except maybe day one where I used a bit too much of the Shea Souffle, so my hair needed a day to just absorb and settle in a bit. But overall, I would say that I definitely recommend, honestly, every single one of these products from the new Lush Curl line. I'd say my top three favorites is the super milk the curl conditioner and the curl power cream but honestly if you can grab them all <music> Thank you so so much for watching you guys i hope you have a beautiful rest of your day don't forget to watch alexa's video i'll have it linked in the down bar below and i'll also have it linked on the screen and don't forget also your frizz is beautiful bye guys see you in the next one